Oh, wait, wait, welcome back to Assassin's Creed Odyssey. So, in the last part, we made it to like this whole sex town where people just have Cleo. sex with people. Cleo. Has anyone seen Cleo? And now we're helping this lady. Come on, talk to me. By Aphrodite. Cleo better get back here soon. Maybe there's something a mercenary can do for you. How did you know I needed help? Anthusa told me you could use a hand. Cleo, one of our girls, didn't meet me for prayer this morning. She wasn't at home either. I'd go investigate, but I'm not sure what I could do on my own. I bet you she she's dead. Taken. I asked around. One of our clients said he saw Cleo brought aboard the ship. The men were armed, so there was nothing he could do. I'd pay a lot of drachmi to get her back. Oh, really? How much? Okay, I'll find her. Armed. Take me to the ship. We'll get Cleo back. Man, she went to a full sprint. She must really care about whoever this is. Wouldn't be the first time the mongers' men came after one of us. Oh boy. Who is this? Preptinos, the lucky drunk. Okay. Where are these? Less damage from assassinations, less damage from poison. Those are some nice bracers though. Okay, let's see if we can just sneak right past them. Where'd she go? Why are you crouching? Oh, because I'm crouching? Look how there's two different types of running in this game. There's what Cassandra has, which is like a nice little jog. And there's what like all, every other woman has, which is like a scattered feet with like arms pointed outwards kind of run. Like we're both women, but we both run very different ways. Wait, are we going to my ship? Did my men take her aboard? Ooh, that'd be awkward. We're still going to my ship. Are you sure there isn't a confusion here? Okay, we're turning right. Oh, is that it out there? There. That's the boat our client described. Please get her back soon. Cleo will die if the ship is destroyed. Well I mean, does she have to live? I guess so. Okay. Man? Time for a rescue mission. Hello, Barnabas. What's up, bitches? I think I miss. There we go. Boom. No, don't worry, we got... We ran first. Well, you know what? You want to pick up a bow and shoot? Hang on, we got this. Alright, let's board. How do we board? Oh, here we go. Hello. What is this? Oh, is that the message board? Oh, bitches! Wait, what's this guy's name I'm fighting? Icarus. I know someone with that name. We're like a bird with that name. All right. Stay back. I'm here to I'm rescue you. Cleo. Rescue me. You sunk my boat, pirate. Don't make me take that knife by force. I was sent here by a friend. Lies. Your friend Erina hired me to save you from these men and bring you back. Even though she didn't Irina, pay me yet. I commissioned that ship to steal me away from Corinth. You're escaping? From what? 
You have no idea what the monger does to people. The things I've seen, no one in Corinth is safe. Irina thought you were abducted. She clearly cares about you. If she cared about me, she'd let me go. Even Anthusa can't keep us safe anymore. She clearly disagrees. Mistios, please. We were heading to Mykonos, which is safe. If you'll take me there, I can pay you the toll I would have paid my crew. Well, who would pay me more? Uh, who do I help? I mean, we're closer to Corinth. Fuck it. Anthusa will take care of you. You need to go back to Corinth. It's your home. Take me against my wishes then. I won't fight you. Damn right you won't. You'll lose that fight. Oh, oh sorry. Oh, is that your boat? Haha. Ha. Oh, is that Poseidon? You got a dick out? He does. Guess what? It's a chode. Alright, welcome home. Even though you don't like it. Guess what? No one cares. Cleo! Oh, did they hurt you? I prayed to Tihi for your safe return. I'm fine, I'm fine. There better not be a scratch on you. I promised this mercenary a month's salary to have you back in one piece. You, you did? did? Of course! You're my dear sister. I'm so thankful Cleo is home. Please, take this for your trouble. Good luck to both of you. That's a month salary, really? Okay, oh by the way, she got herself she made herself get stolen, so have fun discussing that. Bye. Alright, last thing we gotta do for this lady. Burn all the goods in the monger's warehouse. Where is that at? Oh sweet, right over there. Oh. I'm probably not allowed in there, aren't I? Be extra careful in this area. All right, here we go, right? Yep. Now, should I just do stealth, or should I just run and charge, throw flames as I'm running? I mean, that guy's level twenty. God damn. Is there, there aren't a lot of guards here. All right, that works. Hello. This is the place. Time to burn some cargo. Hey, who are you? Do you see nothing? Get speared. Yeah. Oh. Bitch. All right, time to burn this place down to the ground. Is that supposed to be burning? Oh shit, I'm, I'm sorry I didn't see you there. And I want to get out of the fire. You have given me a chance, friend. Thank you. You're welcome. I totally didn't light you on fire on purpose. Oh, hello. You guys de definitely want to clear out of this place before I burn it all down. Go. Alright, that's the last one. Shit, come on, get it. Sweet. Hello. Who the hell is this? Hello there. Yeah, you're gonna wanna run. Oh, 
I don't know who this guy is, but we make a pretty good team. You guys are going to want to run. Nope, they're men. I think I can't throw a spear. I want to try out this other weapon. I don't think it's a spear. I'm not sure what it is. We are double teaming this guy hard. Bitch. Okay. Now. You fight like Where a are you? There's resolve in you. We have that in common. I saw innocents trapped in the flames. The ones in the warehouse. I freed them already. A good soldier acts when he's told. A great one is two steps ahead. Thank you. I'm not even gonna try and pronounce that guy's name. I'd thank you too, if I knew who you were. Brazidas of Sparta. Brazidas. You're a newcomer to Corinth. You're a spy too? An old Spartan tactic. I have my ways. I get the sense that's a Corinthian hobby. Anthusa has her Etera watching from every post. Ah, Anthusa. We disagree, but have a common enemy. The monger? We agree he should be killed, but we differ on how. Uh, by death? Who's that guy? Okay. What do you want to do with him? Right now, the monger rules Corinth. I want to replace him with minimal bloodshed. Don't think that's an option. He'll only be dethroned if he's killed. It's simple. Yes. Diplomacy isn't something he understands. From what I hear, I'm not surprised. We arrested his top men, armed the citizens, tried to stir the police against him. It never came to be. The only thing left to try... Kill him. ...is a quick slice of the blade! That would do it. We'd lure him into Corinthia's sacred cave, and it'd be over! Uh, this guy seems alright. Unless he's the monger. Ooh, that'd be a double twist. I'll help you anyway. By the time I leave Corinthia, the monger will be dead. Do that, and Sparta will be in your debt. I was Spartan. Once. Once? Until I was thrown off Mount Aietos as a child. And left for dead. You're the daughter of General Nikolaos? Am um, I that popular? Knows your name. And here you are. Alive. Impossible. Well, I'm standing right here. I survived. I raised myself alone while life continued in Sparta. Never mind being a Spartan. Those of good character will forgive and should be forgiven. I'm on the hunt for my mother, Mirini. And the only way is through Anthusa. Yes, Mirini. Do you know her? You don't know anything about Mirini, do you? I know that no one should have to endure such tragedy alone. And I heard she left Sparta that night. No one has forgotten Mirini. And how did everyone what lose I her? Know, she wanted them to forget. There's no going back now. The displaced can always find their way home. The gods have just decided you must fight for it. They couldn't make it any easier. Chin up, Spartan. Easy doesn't exist. It does if you turn that setting on. Goodbye, Brasidas. We'll meet again. I'm in the fight with you. Show courage. Okay, bye. Bounty hunter. Oh shit, he's right there. Better go. Monger down. Alright, let's go do that. Anthusia, talk to her in her home. Alright. I should ask Anthusia if she knows this guy and he's not by any chance the monger. Is there anyone she might know? Where is she? Nope. There we go. Hello. 
Your plan seemed to work. The mongers' thugs ambushed me. I heard. I also heard you had no problems dealing with them. It wasn't my first fight in Corinth. Or your last. We're going to take the monger to task at the theater. I've arranged a Corinthian drama no one will forget. Brasidas is worried about the anarchy that could follow the monger's death. He wants him dead, but wants it done quietly. That man is a long way from Sparta. This is Corinthia, so we'll do it the Corinthian way. Start the shoes. Oh, man. I mean, the theater would be more awesome, but there could be a lot more guards there. Let's do in the cave. I agree with Brasidas. I say we take him to the sacred cave. This isn't what we planned. The monger needs to be erased from existence. We'll fight him in a private place, and he'll die. A simple transaction, remember? You if want to do it yourself? Insist, we'll meet you at the sacred cave. Oh, your target is currently three levels above you. Let's go try it. Let's just... I mean, I'm not going to be the only one fighting him, am I? There could be other guys fighting him. Oh, wait, he's in here? I thought we were fucking taking him in here. Like, ambush style. Oh, God damn it. I know I'm going to be fighting him by myself. Is that him? Nope, that's a statue. So it is you, a demigod in the soot and shit streets of Corinth? Killing my men, helping those fucking parasites. I'm guessing you're the monger. That's me. Ah, arrogant. Just like your mother. Yeah, so you do know her. Where is she? If you tell me, I'll be on my way. You'll never rule these streets, you pig. Oh, you bet your pretty face I will. Get your filthy hands. And when I do, I'll rip your fucking head right off and send it to the cult as proof. How insightful. You guys had one interaction? Maybe? She called you a pig and you said you're... Rip her head off? Nice. You knew? Oh, I fucking knew her alright. She was big fucking trouble. But I'll pay her back. When I'm done with you, I'm gonna find your mother and bring her your fucking head. Vimos will wish she was watching this. Not if I bring her yours first. Get the fuck out of my city. No, I'm it's good. It's not yours anymore. Get the fuck off my streets. Oh, so this guy's part of the cult? No, oh, he's a level 20. That's not three levels, that's two. Come on. You're going to fight me? Oh, come on, this is not fair. Ow. Alright, I'm taking all these guys first. All right, one more guy left, and then I'm fighting you. All right, mommy, mommy, man, let's do this. Ooh, that does a lot. Damn it! Why'd you dodge? I can get off. Come on. Goodbye, monger. Okay, I'll oh, talk. I thought I was just going to slice your throat. Wish I could have been there to watch the most break your neck. Don't make me laugh. Does this guy even have a neck? Wait, no! The people of Corinth must see him die. Anthusa. Take him out of here and bring him to the theater. Show everyone he's cowardice. Nah, he'll probably try and fight back. No. See? That easy. Now just drag his body through the street. Simple as that.
You wanted him dead. Here he is. It's a shame that people don't get to see him bleed. His cries should have rung out across the city. They echo through this cave. Dead. I've delivered. Your turn. Huh. Yes. You're right. He's dead. Take his body to the square. Let the people get a last good look at him. Can you not do anything? How much do you think you, this Cassandra, monster weighs? I owe you information. We'll talk about your mother, just not here. Why not? It's going to be a more perfect place. There's no one here except me, you, and a dead hunk of meat. People suck. Also, 100%, if she told me the info, I definitely wouldn't help her anymore. So, that's probably why. I can't give you enough thanks for what you've done. <laughs> and for once, I can also thank Alcibiades. He sent you here, after all. There's more to him than meets the eye. He knew mm. you could save Corinth from that beast. It's no secret that I'll also benefit from his death. Let's talk. Yes, Mirini. She came and left Corinthia in a flurry, but made an impression on me. Like a great storm. I remember that part of her well. A strong woman with great intensity. She wanted to find her place here in Corinth, but never found what she was looking for. You speak of her kindly. You were her friend. Perhaps on the surface, but she had a great pain in the middle of her that no one could get to. Uh, just tell me where. After Corinth. Where did she go? A vet? I don't know. Come on. She must have given you some hint. I don't think even she knew where she was headed. All I know is she won a ship thanks to a lucky dice throw. Tihi owed her that much, at least. I remember the ship's name well. Siren Song. Siren Song? It was famous for weathering all that Poseidon threw in its path. Thank you, Anthusa. May the gods look well upon you, Cassandra. Visit me any time. I'll catch you up on Corinth's affairs. It seems I have an interesting future ahead of me. So do I. Siren Song. If I can find someone who knows the ship, I'll be one step closer to finding her. Okay. So... The only hints we got so far are is leveled up. Her new name is Phoenix, and she is captain, maybe, of a ship called Siren Song. What am I going to learn next? She wears fashion Gucci shoes? How can no one tell me where she is? Okay, uh, well, I'm going to leave this part here, but in the next part, we are going to do no harm. By talking to this dude. So thank you all for watching. Be sure to ever down below. Leave a like, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you on the next part. Goodbye.